you say to people who claim that there's no such thing as biological sex? For example, I sent, I don't know if you got a chance to look at the video. There was a professor who said, there is no such thing as biological sex. I'm a historian of medicine and I can debunk that. But then he didn't go on to debunk it. Well, I think that that's not correct, that there is such a thing as biological sense. But where we draw the line is, um, uh, and where it's been drawn before by uh, scientists and doctors, is pretty shameful and has been revealed to be false in, in retrospect. I think that uh, Anne is in, uh, my wife Anne is in earshot, but uh, uh, she'll tell you that back in the 70s when she was a young woman, it was received scientific wisdom that women's bodies would fall apart if they were to run a marathon. How's that? And so what is essentially male and female, I think, so often is socially constructed for the benefit of the powerful members of, of, um, of societies. And so more often than not, we have to pay attention to, to the socially constructed um, um, aspects. So, but uh, at the end of the day, we just have to let the chips fall where they, where they may.